I just awakened. Apparently, the authority of Area 35 or of Algeria as a whole uh, doesn't wish to resolve the problem, and the reason is that uh, the policy is un pervers. Uh, ils sont là pour violer les gens, et c'est seulement ça qu'ils font. Uh, ils ont une maladie cérébrale. Je ne sais pas comment ils ont, mais ils ont une mal maladie cérébrale. And another form of mental illness, actually. And they're just doing this. And uh, pour être très clair avec vous, ils font ça contre des chefs d'État étrangers, des diplomates étrangers. Ici, à Bomretas, où il a 35. Les individus qui sont ici, qui vivent ici. Voilà. Euh, je vais être clair avec vous. Il y a la juridiction algérienne. Je n'ai pas vécu dans la juridiction algérienne jusqu'au euh, jusqu'au jusqu'au le comment dire ça le trafic humain à qui je à qui j'ai été victime avant les élections allemandes qui m'a amené vers, euh, vers ce lieu. And apparently the and it's the individuals who are in here and apparently they are criminals and now this criminality the person who they are actually targeting now One is a prince, the other is a head of state, others are ministers, others are members of parliaments, others are CEOs, others are this and others are that and others are this. I've been in here for over three years. No individual has been willing to speak with me about work. They only, speak, uh, they only wish to speak about sex. They only launch insult. They try to assault, they try to rape, and way more. And when we speak to the police, the police committed an act of terrorism. And when the new policeman arrives, or the because we, we, we write, they have someone who catches. This is what happens. They have someone who catches the postal services, And those postal services then send it to other individuals. They have ha they have no wish to understand. They just wish to maintain a person who even attack the Spanish state. This it's not I call him crazy for no reason. He attacked the Spanish state and well, Spain gave us money for the gas. Uh, For the gas that we provide, that a uh, few companies in here provide via the state resources. However, they are like individuals, they just laugh like this. <laughs> they just laugh like this uh, about what is happening. It's like a complete case of mental illness just displayed for the entire planet. Justice pay to individuals. This country has now 58 states and they just work all day long. They don't do shit. They work all day long. They try to maintain their uh, religious sick beliefs. That's not faith. That's not faith that is protected by UNESCO or those other uh, or those other international organizations. It's faith which it's faith with the, which is supported by foreign military forces, and it's faith with which, which is uh, supported by uh, probably terrorist organization organizations. There is a book, and in that book, no one there is a book over there, and in that book, no one said that uh, it said. Uh, that do not enter houses which are not yours without and 
just we just having we also have like this kind of foreign females basically behave like bitches actually and we are in here going to going to a new year to a new presidency and uh, it has been a total chaos for the entire world except for the author authoritarian regimes except for the nazi regime except for the fascists i could describe it this way while vanst was present as a head of uh, as a head of government in denmark it was an authoritarian uh, nazi fascist continent or fascist world and they just keep on piling up it's like people with no expertise people with no anyth with no anything they they steal money they steal from the postal services and when they commit the theft they create some type of uh, how to say this they create some type of uh, they create some type of like problematic or a scheme in order to justify the theft it's like uh, he's not affiliated with anything uh, i would say this it's individuals uh, at best these individuals at best they are risk analysis individuals and uh, it's a total shame what is happening in front of the world I mentioned the person is here is actually Russian the one of the foreign office I went there repeatedly there is no guarantee with the police officers who are in here there is no guarantee that they will not conduct prostitution and we told them these are individuals who are doing prostitutions apparently it's his nature is like uh, we have a country they hire anyone and from that anyone they are basically thieves rapists uh, terrorists uh, state aggressors and way more who just walk down the streets and uh, let me say this clearly <coughs> it's like this piece of paper this is what missing it's like this piece of paper it's like a piece of paper like this filled in here and that piece of paper is similar to this one this is a piece of paper it's similar to this one which I obtained in uh, October uh, uh, November 2010 and October 2010 Uh, you know it was a harsh time for everyone you know uh, it's not people who respect the law it's people who respect the anarchy and we are moving and uh, he's a crazy person a group of crazy people who are cops who are doing all of these crazy actions against Italy and against Italy probably the capital against uh, Italian institutions against uh, people in Spain they come all the way in here this is why I'm telling you ministers who are abroad they come all the way in here and they get involved with other which is called in France Association de Malfita they come all the way in here they grouped up with other individuals and they cause all of those troubles he inherently believes it's his belief that uh, that Nazi scum who attacked world leaders and who attacked international institutions and who attacked monarchies is well suited to some to go to that certain position than this guy and these people are outside and he go there like a macho man macho man he, just, he behave like a macho man huh? and he thinks he can do whatever he wants he thinks that he has all of the power in the world 
and you just in here probably one of them is selling food the other what do they do like instead of extracting oil from the ground they uh, they put people in the ground and they extract extract nutrients from them it's like complete horror and it keeps on horrifying actually the first instance is like uh, in this country of Algeria if there is like a general of a certain armed forces and apparently the Ministry of Defense or the the people who defend the country we have at least eight branch this is the minimum that they have they have eight branches or they have only eight branches I don't know exactly and if you call the chief from all of those eight branches it's like how come you are attacking the attacking the foreign leaders how come you're obstructing justice how come you're adding complexity and there is a complete silence about it and now now uh, uh, after I completed the because I have like eight faces I just I just trying to keep them in my hand the further way but like uh, I cannot complete phase seven because it's a crucial phase and uh, if I complete it maybe it will happen the theft of scientific work so even in Europe there are those uh, sick racist uh, idiots who don't work and who just steal other people's work and create havoc in their own country and the havoc that you found in Sweden or in Germany now or in Belgium or in those it's because the native citizen of the country commits crimes as is going on now and he's in here he's committing crimes uh, the authorities didn't jail him the authorities didn't even jail him for attempted coup they jailed him uh, and it kept on happening and they have all of these sick beliefs within themselves it's like uh, I keep on describing the situation and it's basically phasing uh, what is called a complete Nazi scumbag this is all that how I could resume the situation 